day 28 TDR. That's four weeks now, 100% on plan. Tomorrow weigh day, so watch this face to see what my um, weight loss is this week and how much in total. Today, what's really, really struck me is the difference for me between a weekday and a weekend. And um, this is something I'm really going to focus my thoughts on. Um, as I kind of said over the weekend, um, it, it, a weekend's very difficult for me. And I'm really, really trying to give that all my thought. Particularly yesterday, I, um, I was very, very busy. And being busy is my way, I thought, of coping with um, distracting myself through being on plan. Um, so to stop me thinking about food and what have you, I distract myself. But actually, I've had this realisation, which I kind of always knew, and um, because I talk with you guys about it a lot, but I'd not really faced it in myself, that keeping busy for me is one of the ways to stop myself from thinking and to stop myself from musing on the, those uncomfortable thoughts. And um, it was clear as day yesterday that I thought when I look back on my video that I was not a happy bunny. And so what I did yesterday evening was I um, had a chat with my husband and just cleared the air and told him exactly how I was feeling and faced those uncomfortable feelings. And it worked. You know, I think that part of my feeling a lot better today is that I'm very busy <laughs> with clients, but also because I have um, made myself lean in to those sharp points. As I'm always talking about, I leaned into how uncomfortable I was feeling. I really looked at, I mean, this is going to sound so ludicrous, but I was hoovering and mopping, even though we've got the cleaner coming tomorrow. And when I sort of had that thought in my head, I thought, hang on a minute, what's going on here? And stop leaning away by keeping busy, start leaning in. And it wasn't until I leaned in and faced those uncomfortable feelings that I've then been able to decide what I'm going to do about that and then move through it. And so I've moved through them now. I've dealt with it and I don't have those uncomfortable feelings anymore because it's a situation that I've been able to manage. So this opportunity when you're on plan to remove yourself completely from the food if you're on the lower steps is just bloody brilliant because it lays it out there for you all those uncomfortable feelings that you're having that you can no longer hide from with the food you might try by keeping yourself very busy like me and those are just it's such a wonderful opportunity to actually then deal with them and and get on with your life <laughs>